Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, let's just stay seated because you're on. I don't even know what I was about to say. Hey guys, how y'all doing? Welcome back for another vlog. Hope you guys are doing well. I am doing superb. I done had my little pick me up for the day, girl. I went and stopped at McDonald's, got me some coffee, y'all. So your girl is feeling good. I um, I smell good, okay? I smell fresh and clean. I look like a mama today. Mm -hmm. Cause it's like so dreary, it's dark out here. It, it's been raining off and on. And it's just one of those days, hey. <laughs> How y'all doing today? How y'all doing today? Hope y'all are doing well. I'm doing well. Y'all, I'm getting ready to head to um, Costco. And I just want to say thank you guys for showing so much love and support on my previous video. I love y'all so much. Y'all make sure y'all like my videos because it helps the algorithm. It helps the channel out a lot. Share my videos. If you, um, if you would, that's all I ask you to do. It's free. It don't cost you a thing to support your girl so like the video comment down below if it's just an emoji of a heart sign or anything like that it definitely helps the channel out and it helps the engagement brands love to see engagement on channels or what have you and also it also becomes recommended on um other people who don't know about me so it is february the i don't even know what date it is i ain't got my watch on or nothing let me look at my phone. Hold on, y'all. It's February the 4th. It's February the 4th. And um, it's going to be a good month. I don't know why I feel it. I mean, y'all, yesterday, when I say I was having a really, really bad day yesterday, like I didn't hardly record anything yesterday. I did. I think I might have done one reel for Facebook. And that's it. And normally I do it. I try to at least do like three or four reels per day. But yesterday I only did one reel. And it was just, I was just in a little funky behind mood. I didn't want to be bothered. Y'all know we're entitled to have like bad days. We are entitled to have bad days. You know what I'm saying? But my good days always outweigh my bad days. But those bad days, I can appreciate on days like this. And I feel good about myself because, and another thing that I love, that my husband, when he knows I'm, I'm having a bad day, he always seems to, to say the right things just to brighten my day up. And if it's just coming home and warping my stomach, 
I mean, it'd be like some of the smallest things that if he know I got an attitude about something or if he feel like I'm in an ill not not mood, he'll come home, rub my stomach, rub my hair, or just, you know, just come and kiss me on my on my cheek and tell me it's gonna be okay. Just something so small like that, it just really, really helps me. I don't have to have a whole bunch of money in the bank. I don't have to have the, the latest latest pocketbook or latest uh, bag. I mean, I like those things. Don't get me wrong. And, and you know what I'm saying? Like, I can definitely buy my own bag if I want to, but I'm just saying. It's those little small gestures that kind of just make me feel better about myself sometimes. and just makes me feel good overall. So, but yeah, yesterday was a rough day for me, y'all. Just emotionally. You know how you can just be emotionally frustrated about everything? When life just throw you those curveballs and you just kind of let it get the best of you? Like, yeah, it was one of those days yesterday. And when I'm feeling like that, I don't pick up the camera. Um, because I don't want to project that type of energy off into someone else. Because I know a lot of people look at me and I know um, as being a... a um, as an influencer or someone that I can make an impact on, I don't want to ever come off as being a negative Nancy. And on those days, I just don't, I just some, I just withdraw from recording. You know what I'm saying? Because I know different people come on my channel for different reasons and I don't want to ever come off as being a negative Nancy. Um, and I do try to be transparent, but on those days, if I ain't feeling it, I just ain't feeling it. And I'm not going to come on here and try to fake the funk with y'all like everything is all gravy when it ain't. You know what I'm saying? That's just ain't me. I don't roll like that. You know what I'm saying? It ain't no guessing with me. You see me, you see me. You don't see me, you'll know why. She must be, she must, she going, she, she in her feelings. You know what I'm saying? I don't stay in my feelings long, but anyway. That's that. But anyway, we're going to Costco because I need to get a few things from Costco. And y'all are going to roll with me. We're riding. We're in these dreary, low ball, low light streets of America. <laughs> we in America, y'all. Living life to the fullest. And yeah, that's all I got to say right now. So I, when we get to Costco, I'll call y'all. All right, so I made it in Costco, y'all, and this Ninja Foodie right here, this is the double air fryer that I want. This is the 100, I'm not 100, 10 quart air fryer for 169 here at Costco. And I actually want to get this. This is something that I do have on my appliance wish list. And now that I see that Costco has it, so when I'm ready to buy, this is the Ninja Foodie XL with the two basket air fryer bigger and faster so the one that we currently have now is uh the single one and it's tore up completely and it's time for a new one so this is the one that i want to come back and get when i'm ready to buy so y'all they've got these uh hospitality washcloths 24 pack for 12.99 and y'all, they are like so thick. These are like perfect. I think I'm about to get me a pack of these. So, yep, let me go ahead and grab this 24 pack of white washcloths. And it's the Grand Grandeur. Am I saying it right? Grandeur? Grandeur Hospitality Washcloths. These are the thick ones. So, yeah, I'm definitely getting a pack of those. And look, they got the hand towels too. I'm like, the hand towels are $17.99. I don't really use hand towels like that. My husband does like the hand towels. Let's see. Oh, they're real good and thick too. I think I can do away with the hand towels right now. And then it look like they got the six pack of the bath towels and they are they $25.99. Oh gosh, yep. Yeah. And how many, how many is in the six pack? Oh. Uh, even though I got plenty of good towels, but this hotel style towel, I don't think, I don't think you could ever have many, I don't think you could ever have too many towels. So I'm about to get a pack of these. Alright. Let's see what else they got. 
They even got these white bath towels right here. This is by the brand Charisma. I think I'm saying that right. Charisma white bath towels. They're $7.99 for one. But these are the luxury bath towels. Oh my God, y'all. When I say these are so soft. See, see, I want these instead now because they are so luxe. They're like, they are so plush, y'all. When I say these are super, super soft. Dang. I don't know which one I want to get now. Oh my God, these are so, they feel so freaking good, y'all. Oh, they feel so good. They got them in this white, this sage green, this look like an oatmeal color. And then I've got this tan or taupe color. I guess this is tan. They've got like this green, between green and blue. I don't know what color this is. I don't know what color coming off from the camera. And then they've got, yeah, the sage green again and the baby blue. Oh God, these are so freaking soft. And they even got the gray down there too. Okay, so this is what I originally came in here for, the fish. Y'all see they got the salmon here. They got the Atlantic cod. They got the wild ahi tuna. The mahi mahi. They got the whole snapper. Uh, what is this, tilapia. What is this? Branzino farm raised. This is the, okay, so this is the whole tilapia. I don't see where they got the catfish at. I really want some catfish. Of course, they got the mussels and the lobster tails. Y'all, do y'all see how hot seafood is now? Two lobster tails for 61.58. They have really drawn up on everything. They got the shrimp with the head on, the scallops, the, I don't even know what this is. What is this? Is this like crawfish meat? I'm guessing so. And then the king crab legs. This king crab leg pack right here is $71, y'all. For well, these three legs, no, excuse me, two legs for $71.58. Okay, not in my budget today. Well, for my seafood luggage, they do got the king crab, the box of king crab for $3.89. Let's zoom in on that, y'all. Do y'all see that? $3.89 a box. Uh, no. They used to be like $2.75, but they have gone up almost to $400. Are you freaking kidding me? I don't need seafood that bad. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ham. So y'all, I asked the uh, the meat man over there in the meat section if they had any catfish because that's what I really, really wanted, some catfish and some, um, yeah, catfish. And he was like, they don't even have any right now. The only thing they had was what I showed you guys earlier. So that's unfortunate. He was like, check back tomorrow. They might have some. But in the meantime, I like to get these uh, takeout crispy chicken. They are $17.99. My family loves this bag. And this is the takeout sweet Chipotle barbecue. So I'm gonna get a bag of that. They normally have another flavor, but I don't see that they have that other flavor. It's normally the Chipotle, sweet Chipotle, and then they also have another flavor as well. I can't remember exactly what the flavor is. Um. Dang, what is the name of the flavor? I can't think of it. If I find it, I'll show y'all what I'm talking about. But normally, I like to get the two bags of that because we'll run through these bags in no time. These brown sugar boba ice milk bars, y'all, I purchased these one time before for my family. And when I say they are so good and it has the little boba, the little bubbles inside it, y'all see that? And I say these are so good. I'm not gonna get none this time because our deep freezer is pretty much packed to capacity. But if y'all are ever in Costco and looking for something really, really good, like a milky, a milky ice cream bar, definitely try these out. And they're only $13.79. I see that they got these keto bars here too. I know I got a few followers that are on the keto diet, so 
if you have a Costco, y'all come check these out. These are the sea salt caramel keto ice cream bars, and they are let's see, eight ninety nine. Okay, so I found the other flavor that I was telling y'all about. So these are the classic buffalo, and I don't know exactly how much they are, but I'm gonna get a bag of these for my family as well. So I'm gonna get a bag of those, and they are $17.99. So yeah, so the classic buffalo was the other flavor. I couldn't remember the name of them, but I'm glad that they had them. So for our seasonings, I normally like to get the blend, which is the salt, pepper, and the garlic. So I'll use this. I like using this a lot. They actually have this one. They actually have a prime rib one. Let me go ahead and get, put this in the buggy. And they also have a um, prime rib. I've never seen this one before. I think this is about the brand. I think you say it kinders. Kinders, this is the prime rib rub. And then they also have one with the lemon pepper and I'm wondering if I should get the lemon pepper because I have never tried the lemon pepper I wonder how that tastes and I think I'm gonna get it I'm gonna try the lemon pepper as well and they are uh, $6.99 so yeah I'm gonna try the lemon pepper and see what it what it do so for my keto friends out there that are doing keto, if y'all are looking for like a nice snack at uh, Costco, they have these dark chocolate, coconut, almond, and sea salt little treats right here. 85% um, cacao, I think I'm saying that right, but this is the dark chocolate. And I think they are priced at, let's see, they are priced at $7, $7.99. So they got the dark chocolate right here. And it looks like they have some more on the other side. Hold on, y'all. And they've got these no sugar keto bars. Let's see. Uh, no sugar keto bar, three net carbs, and they've got the chocolate peanut butter and the chocolate fudge brownie. And they are, how much are these? Uh, $5.99. Yeah, so for my keto, keto friends out there, if y'all are interested, Costco has some cute little snacks for you guys to try. Okay, my keto lovers. They also have these gluten-free keto crackers. Um, it's got pumpkin seeds, almonds, and hemp seeds in these little crackers. Four grams of net carbs here at Costco and they are $8.49. Okay, so I am done with my little quick run to Costco, y'all. And so, ugh, who this door was heavy. So I end up running into a uh, a supporter i ran up ran into a supporter so hey girl i forgot your name but dang what, what did she say her name was but anyway when you see this you'll know um and she did want to be on camera which is very which is expected which is fine with me it's, it's okay because everybody don't like to be on camera but um if you're looking at this which i'm sure you are hey girl hey but um and then i met her and then I um, ran into a worker that uh, watches a lot of Costco hauls, whatever. He saw me with my camera. He was like, are you a YouTuber? I'm like, yeah. He was like, he loves watching Costco hauls because a lot of stuff that he sees at his Costco, a lot of other Costco's don't have it. And he was like, he just found the love of watching Costco hauls and stuff like that. So he was like, now they show up on his news feed. And I was like, yep, I do YouTube, I do YouTube. And I gave him my channel name or whatever, so I don't know if he's gonna check me out or not, but shout out to the Costco worker and shout out to my supporter. Hey, girl. Anyway, I um, I was tempted to go get me a hot dog or a slice of pizza, but this coffee, when I drank coffee, I noticed that it kind of curves my appetite. And I'm like, I'm, if I would be getting it, I would just be getting it just to be greedy, and I'm really not hungry. 
so I didn't get it. I ain't gonna do it, girl. I ain't gonna do it. So I didn't do it. I would, did not yield to temptation. So I'm pretty sure this is probably a short video, you guys. But all February, we we coming with the we coming with them. We 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 back to work. We back to work. So I'm pretty sure this is going to be probably be a short vlog. But you guys stay tuned because we got more footage coming. I got some stuff in the woodworks. So y'all just bear with me. Support your girl or whatever. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you keep looking good. Make sure you keep smelling good. Oh, and the only thing I ended up getting, you guys, was the towels, the washcloths, which y'all already saw. The two bags of chicken and the two things of seasoning. That's all I ended up getting. So it's not really worth me showing y'all because y'all already saw what I got anyway. But anyway, I'm in the video here. Y'all remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all later with another video. Bye.